hello everyone welcome to my channel and today we are going to learn about how to install the log stash so first we have to download the log stash 8.12 last time we have read about how to install Elasticsearch and then we have read about the how to install the Kibana and configure with Elasticsearch so if you haven't watched the videos you can go to my channel and view that videos these were videos these are prerequisites for the this video without this you will not be able to understand what's going on and if you haven't subscribed my channel yet please subscribe it share it and let's start today's agenda first we will type the download log stash for download log stash Okay. we will click here and it will redirect us to the log stash page log stash download page and from here we are going to select the window machine as we have already using it so let me just quickly download the windows version and it will start downloading the windows log stash and we will wait, wait for that okay so now till then we are going to do one thing we are going to start the elastic search and kibana okay just uh, open your folder and suppose you want to start the elastic search so just go here and type cmd and just type cd dot backslash bin sorry backslash last e tab just type e and uh, just type e let me do it again for you cd space dot backslash and just type e and press the tab button on keyboard so it will automatically fill out the available available folders name that match with e okay and then I have to go inside that folder and I will just say bin B and press the tab so it will automatically type the bin and again I have to type the backslash I will say there is a name called file name called elastics EL so there isn't any right now okay so I will just type this one so I am right now in the bin folder of the elastic search and then I will just say elastic search dot b and this will be elastic search dot bat and just hit enter so first we have entered in the bin folder of the elastic search so now our elastic search is completely up and running you can see this yellow our status has been health status of the cluster has been changed to yellow current health is yellow okay so now we are ready to go so now we will start up the kibana okay so i will just say sorry so you have to whatever you have to open like uh, first we have went through the cd method now right now i'm just opening the kibana now i am inside the kibana folder i will just click here and type cmd and uh, cmd and hit enter okay so i will be directly inside that folder so uh, now just type cd space bin to go inside the bin folder and then i type just ki and press the tab button press the tab button so you will say kibana.bat kibana.bat bat so hit enter now so what it will do it will start up the kibana so we will wait for the kibana to be completely up and running now let's check if our log stage completely downloaded so i will move that file from downloads to the, this folder i have moved the log stage from downloads to this in folder my folder now what i will do i will just click on extract here so it will just extract the log stash and our log stash will be completely extracted and let's see our kibana status so still the kibana is in the initiating process 
so we will wait for that to be completely up our kibana is now completely up and we have already extracted the fox stash so what we are going to do is we are find this property so it's saying the log stash has three basic structure let me just quickly remove this one so let me copy this one okay for you I will just say to copy to make you understand about this structure a little bit so this is the copy okay so this basic structure of log stash is input okay there will be input and there will be filter there will be output so these three will be the plugins that we are going to use input there will be input plugins to get the data inside the log stash and there will filter if you want to do any manipulation or aggregations or removing or any touching in the data then you will use the filters and if where you want to send the data or where you want to send to the either you can you can send directly to the elastic search and elastic search will send the data to the kibana visualization now if you can you can use many type of uh, beats or file paths or whatever type of input you want to use from where you want to see the data so this is the basic structure of log stash to run this you first need to rename the file let me just say testing log stash okay log stash stash dot conf so i will just add this pipeline here to your file so you don't mess up the thing so our path was not correct so i have just given change the path and always there will be always two backslash okay so what I will do, I just clear screen, CLS, and I can run the blog stash. So now you can see our pipeline is started. The pipeline ID is this one, and it's running. And there are nothing to include our output, so they have not not given anything. Uh, in our next video, we will learn more about inputting from the files and we will input some of the hello world csv and we will learn more about the log stash this was it for the log stash installation thank you so much we will meet you in the next video